Wow, the best thing is my womb, <laughs> because it's the best womb. You know, when you are a writer, it's so difficult to find the place, first one, and the time, it's the second question in your life. So you have to keep away from the world, to walk far away from the world, to take place in your own world, with your own characters, with your own worlds, and just do it, just finish your work. So I think for me the best the best thing is to find a room, my room, even if it's small, even if it's uh, sometimes cold because the weather is not good, but just to put my characters in a box. I live in Paris, so Paris is not the French. So I can maybe I can talk about the the friends I know and the Paris I love. The Paris I love is a place in which everything is possible because everyone can meet everyone. Black people, white people, white people, Chinese people, you know we are a lot. So a lot of communities and it's like the patrol. You know, I can feel, I can feel myself with this lot of communities. So it's really interesting because there are a lot of worlds inside a world. And Paris, you can visit Paris by feet, just walking, walking. And each time you walk, maybe 10 minutes, it's a French quarter. And another area is African area. So you can find a lot of things just by walking and just by seeing the things. You know, last time I was in Chicago, I was so upset. Okay, it was great, it was amazing, you know, a lot of buildings, very, very tall, but you can't look at the sky and the sky can't look at you. So the relationship you have got with the God is very, very like that. I prefer in Paris because I can see the sky, blue, grey, whatever, but it is. I must confess that I only read novels, only novels, because uh, I don't want to spend too much time on my computer just to see blogs. There are a lot of blogs, so I can't. I can read the blog of my sister. I've got a sister, Veronique, and she made a blog. So I can, okay, I can just connect, just to know a lot of things, but that's it. the last chapter comes I can feel wow it's now it's the end but I have to reach this end so maybe it's the last path you had you have to do for reaching this point and it's a very like adrenaline you know it's uh, not an, an upset but uh, yeah, you have to finish it. As if you read a book, you have to finish it. So you are like that, you are very nervous. And I like this kind, this last exercise before the rest. Yeah, absolutely. You know, writers are very lucky. First one, we have got a lot of opportunities to make residences. As a writer from Europe, we've got a lot, maybe 15, maybe 100. And usually it's exactly such this kind of place without any... Actually, I've got this opportunity and it's uh, very strange because uh, you know there are whole students they want to write they don't know how or some of them know they know just a part of the job but they really want to keep writing and uh, you have to bridge the self-confidence you have to tell them writing is not complicated even if you know 
that's very complicated. Writing is not teaching two things very, very different. And you have just to put your characters and sometimes your ego in a box very far away from you and just to put in the condition to write, to write and to help the others write. I prefer the, the rhythm, the very long, long rhythm, the un, endless rhythm. It's like uh, speaking, I can't speak uh, small but very interesting. I have to, you know, to, to speak, <laughs> to speak with the micro, to speak uh, for a long time and writing at the same time. So I'm very sorry, uh, I, I can't understand uh, poetry. Hmm, uh, how to do this book? Thank you very much. I'm very happy because it's the mid, uh, it's the, not the mid, yeah, I think uh, four weeks, four weeks, uh, from now. yeah, from now and four weeks behind me. So I think it's the middle of the river. So I'm very, very, very happy and at the same time upset because I have to finish a book. A fucking book. I have to finish it. So it's a it's a challenge. Yeah, yeah. It's really a challenge. <laughs>